So it's amazing that we have day camp this year um, that's going on simultaneously with overnight camp for the first time. Um, and uh, day camp has been amazing. So you have kids that are coming from pre-K all the way to sixth grade, rising sixth graders. Um, and they get the chance to have a whole bunch of different uh, opportunities for uh, different platforms of you know specialties that we have from photography, from stomp, music, uh, drama, art, tons of different platforms there so that's part of our uh, diversity within our programming and then uh, as well as just uh, the opportunity for them to be in republics and learn about one another, learn about their differences, learn about um, just each other, some of the things that they have similar as well too so but, but within that they have the opportunity to look at the differences that they have and see that even in the midst of that they're still not that different that we all have the same issues the same problems um, and we all need one God and one love through Christ Jesus the center of Barefoot's mission is Jesus Christ and at the heart of Jesus is love and our purpose is to show love to students and to let them know that God loves them and that because of that they can love others my role with Barefoot started about four years ago. I am a speaker and teacher during three or four weeks of the summer, and I also help write the Bible study curriculum. So I'm involved in lots of different aspects, but mostly in the speaking and teaching. What I love about Barefoot is that it brings together people of different races, cultures, and socioeconomic backgrounds, but all under the umbrella of the gospel of Jesus Christ. We don't all just come here to play soccer. We don't all just come here to do art. We come here because we love God and because we want to show other people that we love God. So when all of the kids are gathered together and I look out there and I see different races, different cultures, and different backgrounds, it's really encouraging because I know that that's at the heart of God. Kids get an opportunity to do music, sports, film, photography, skateboarding, outdoor adventure, archery, um, soccer, football, dance, drama, you name it we try to offer it at camp and it's a cool platform because when kids are coming to camp they might initially think that they don't have things in common with one another but then kids will be in soccer class together and both realize that they like soccer or both get to shoot a bow and arrow for the first time and figure out how fun that is. And so they're building relationships and their activities and then they're um, hearing the gospel preached and what those what a Christ-centered relationship should look like. And their relationships just go that much deeper. So what may start in a music class, in a soccer class, um, doing outdoor adventure, hiking together, it grows deeper and deeper throughout the week as they learn how the Bible calls us to love each other.